Yo, yo, what's the deal? Six beats. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Here's a little uh, Samsung Admire for dummies. For those who need an instructional on already made instructions on the website that I already posted, but I'll give you the run through of how to get to this page simply by clicking the first link in the description. Okay? So once you click on that link, it'll bring you to this page here. The very first link says one click root for Samsung Admire for Windows, Mac, and Linux. There's also a safely remo removable bloatware, okay? And if you hate those stock sounds, it shows you how to do it here, okay? Um, so I'll click on the first link to show you this page that you'll land on. How to install. You need to put your device in USB debugging mode. To turn it on, go to Settings, Applications, Development, and check the box. Linux and Mac users, it says connect your device to your PC, unpack the archive, and run run.sh. You may need to chmod 755 run.sh. Right? Windows users install the Samsung USB drivers and they even included the download link for those drivers. How nice of them, right? Alright, unpack the archive and open run.bat. Now these are the downloads for the root. Okay, so here's the Windows download and some mirrors. Here's the Linux and Mac download and the mirrors. Okay, so everything is exactly self-explanatory. Oh, it's a one-click root. You open up the archive, extract it somewhere, run the run.sh or the run.bat if you're on Windows, and you're set to go. There's one user that had to put enable copy files to and from computer. Obviously, you do have to have the phone connected to the PC or the Mac um, system that you have. So, connect it, enable USB debugging, and enable copy files to and from computer. That should clear up any mishaps that may happen. All right, And then, if you still are not rooted, that means you need to install superuser.apk from the market and you are done. That's it. So I was officially the first one to achieve this Samsung Admire root with the dev DJR Bliss. So big ups to him. Now here's a little demo of my phone showing you that I do have the root. Okay. So I'll turn on my screen here. Obviously, it's the same phone that you have if you have a Samsung Admire. All right, so there it goes. Boom. Now I'm in Titanium Backup, but we'll back up out of there real quick. We'll open up Super User. Obviously, you wouldn't be able to get into Super User if it wasn't installed and rooted. Okay, so there it goes. You have that. Now I'm going to forget the permission okay I'm gonna forget the permission for titanium backup boom alright now back up out of there I'll close all programs now reopen up the titanium backup boom you see so yes it does work it is rooted and this is an official Samsung admire okay no hoax or no you know BS on my page I post official videos always Alright, so look, I cleared up some of the system ROM, so you're going to have 19.9 free. I had 1.7 because I removed a, lot, removed a lot of bloatware from the system, so that helped out a lot. And that's pretty much it. Alright, so there it says, root access, okay, BusyBox 1.18, and I'd suggest you download the latest BusyBox. You can also download that from the market. Alright, so happy rooting your Samsung admires. Peace.